Welcome to Pretzel Interviews. Today we'll be taking you into the latest news. Uh, M Sports Day. Wow, this sounds interesting. Our reporter Floppy Fruits has more. Thank you, Pretzel. Yes, Room Twenty in Sunnybrae School had the opportunity to do an M Sports session, a soccer session with M Sports. Luckily. They didn't get any pouring rain this that day, but the class before them did. <laughs> Keen said it was an interesting experience, and he would rate it a seven point five out of ten, not a ten because of sheer boringness, injuries, and stuff. Thank you, dear. Thank you for that, Fluffy. In other news, uh, the Cluster Sports Day. Interesting. Hmm. Our reporter, Moppy Fruits, has more. Thank you for that pretzel. Yes,、uh, this M Sports. No,、uh, not M Sports. This Cluster Sports Day, which is held only once a year, f- um, a few schools、uh, gather up in different venues to play different sports.、Uh, There are sports such as table tennis,、uh, hockey, uh, um, t- soccer, ripper rugby, and netball.、Uh. Sadly, no one in the school for the second year in a row chose hockey. Rip hockey. No one likes you. It's okay, hockey. But that's not my point.、Uh. Keen chose table tennis and went to the venue with nineteen. Eighteen、uh, other students.、Uh, Keen says、uh, last year he did table tennis too, and last year there was this girl that kept on beating everyone and won the whole trophy. Lucky for Keen and the school, there were that girl was nowhere in sight because she was a year seven. And this is just for primary schools.、So. Anyway, the schools were Saint Mary's.、Uh, Sunny Ray, Willow Park, Northcote, and they started off. Keen's team of three people started off pretty well. Um, they only they played seven whole matches and lost five、uh, and lost two of them and won five, but they did not come first. Instead, two other people. From Sunny Bray came first. Two teams from Sunny Bray came first. They got Scotch Diamonds, but Keen's not jealous. He doesn't really like diamonds. Well, that sounds interesting. Um. Oh yes, I've heard that Willow Park School was cheating. Yes, yes, yes. They even stole the victory from us from all their cheats. They said that they had five extra points. That's cheating, you know. They told the people that they had actually five extra points. Those cheaters. Yes, yes. And we heard that they were also cheating in the other sports too. Oh yes, I heard that one. They they supposedly round people and were swearing at soccer. Same for ripper rugby, and they were shocking at netball. Disappointing Willow Park School. Disappointing Willow Park School. <sighs> Willow Park. Disappointing. Thank you for watching Pretzel Interviews.